Have you ever wondered what a year of models for a full-time 3D furry artist looks like? Well, here's all my 3D models for this year. Howdy hi, y'all. My name's Rita Bandito. I make art, I think. I bet y'all didn't know it, but I'm also a full-time freelance VR chat slash VTuber creator. Folks like to call me an animator, which is fair. It seems to be the only thing I put out lately. But my income actually comes straight from the community in making models for folks. I just forget to post my finished models in a way that feels creatively fulfilling. I could just make a turnaround or do one of those cheesy VR chat videos and call it a day, but I would rather suck my face into itself than to do either of those. So let's start right from January. Beginning of the year, I was sponsored by Tremar to make a Gumroad avatar of Cosmic Cartoon Species. Now this base for me had one goal, and it was to make it super customizable. And now let me tell you, this bad boy has so many sliders in it. After the Servians was this frog princess for an IRL friend. Uh, they are so sparkly and they were a ton of fun. I was able to really push their expressions and they're still one of my favorite models I've ever done. Now, did you know Valheim has a mod where you can put your characters into the game? Every year I have a three week spiral where I get survival crafter brain rot. So for two days I modeled three VRMs, a long penguin, a small hedgehog, the absolute menace, Crumpto. Now once Valheim released me, it allowed me to work on Zaldar. Zaldar, all through 2023, he kept coming back for more work. Zaldar has gotten different outfits, AR kit shapes for more precise lip sync, a ton of VR chat additions, and he even sponsored me to learn a new VTubing software called Waryudo. Now last January, I made this commission opening animation. I'm really proud of it, and the response blew me away. I got a ton of submissions, and the first one that I did was Ruth. Ruth was this very fun blue and white dragon. I saw their dragon and I immediately knew what I had to do. Please, please, please let me make it in the style of Spyro Reignited, please. Now, <laughs> with those expert negotiation skills, Ruth agreed. Ruth finished, so Coddle's up next. Coddle was a wicked fun commission. What really grabbed me in this commission were his scent constructs. He wanted some custom expressions and animations, and those were an interesting challenge. Coddle finished, so Syrup is up next. Syrup was a VTubing commission that I took on. They're a Syrup snail. How fucking cool is that? Syrup finished, so Bear is up next. They got a VTuber, a VR chat avatar, and they got my first ever 3D print. Bear's finished. So Azen is up next. Azen had an interesting challenge. They wanted a model inspired by the show Has Been Hotel. Azen is finished. So Cheese Lord is up next. Cheese Lord is a purple red panda with light effects in his fur. After seeing his ref, I knew what I had to do. Please, 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 please let me use this fur shader for more. And please. Cheese Lord got finished. Hayes is up next. Hayes is made out of goo. So Hayes knew what he had to do. Please, Rito, I have this goo shader. Please make my character with this shader, please. You know what I said after those expert negotiations? Yeah, all right. Not big commissions, but like models I made personally or as trades or as gifts. Lightning round. Chitter. My hot bird I'm making for an animation voiced by Abby Cadabry. Chib, that's my partner. I like her a lot, and I wanted to update her model after it had gotten lost. Diane vibes are definitely intentional. I gave a rigging lesson to an artist, and in exchange I got this art. From this art, I propagated my little dude. Abby, who's voicing Chitter, wanted a fix me commission of their low poly model. I did not make the model, but I did optimize it and add some goodies to it. I also made this scrungle for an art trade with Moose, and they made me this. This video was originally going to be about my entire 2023. Trust me, there's a lot. But with three days to the deadline as of writing this script, I needed to pivot. <laughs> uh, you know, I love my work. I love the community that supports my projects. And I'm so thankful that people give me opportunities and trust to put their sonas into something like VRChat or a VTubing software. 
I take pride in my approach to these 3D models. I want it to look and feel like the ref that they give me. I want people to be happy with their virtual identities and getting to have a part in that, to me, is something special. So now, listen, my hambos, thimbos, and bimbos. Thanks for making it this far. Give me that sweet subscription, why don't you? And tell me your favorite model in the comments. Make sure to go check out the other cool peeps that I put in this video. Profiles are in my description. My name is Rito Bandito, and I'll see you stinkers in two weeks.